What's up, YouTube? Arsenic Platinum here. Back again with some more Injustice Gods Among Us. And in the last episode, we fucked people up with Lex Luthor and saw his lit ending. Um, yeah, so uh, it is time to go ham with Catwoman. And I'm gonna go with Selena Kyle. Because the one that we've been seeing is the Amakomi or Amakami. However you pronounce that, I'm gonna call it Amakomi. Alright, come on, Shazam. Shazam the man. Shazam my man! Come on, bruh. Fight me. Begin. Fuck him up. Okay. So her circle button works just like it does in the second game. Taking you down. Nope, I'm not doing it. I'm cut that pretty face. Uh, uh, doing it. Doing yeah, fuck off, motherfucker. <laughs> bye bye. Hmm. All righty. Now Nightwing is chilling here. You can't take him out. You can't be Superman. Bruce wouldn't want you to begin. Fucking use it. Use it all, bitch. What's that? I'm gonna whip ya. Get close, I'm gonna whip ya. Here, have this. One sec. Hold this little powder. Dunzo. Done. <laughs> She's like, you can't stop me, bitch. You can't stop me, bitch. You can't stop me, bitch. So Adam came out recently for Injustice 2, and that, that excites me a lot because the last time I looked, Fight Pack or Fighter Pack 3 wasn't even available yet. So now you can get Adam. Which is awesome because once I have the money, probably for my next paycheck, I'm gonna buy Fighter Pack 3. It's 20 bucks. You get three characters and a premiere skin. Like, worth it, you know? You fucked up, Lolo. You fucked up. I can play this game. I can fucking play this game. Oh, speaking of Adam, there he is right there in the background. He's just chilling. Not giving up, bug. Come here, bitch. Come here, Lobo. You want to pick a fight? You want to pick a fight? Let's fight. Come at me, bitch. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, bitch. 
Come here. I just want to talk. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I just want to talk to you. Come at me again, bro. I dare you. I dare you. Follow through. I dare you. Come at me. Fuck off, bitch. You want to play games? I'll play games. I'm in the gaming mood. In the gaming business. Oh, I'm in a good mood, guys. This is just... I don't know. Things are just going well. I'm enjoying this just like recording two episodes at a time. There's two characters that way I don't get bored of the game. I don't get frustrated with it. I don't want to like fucking... I don't want to kill myself because of it ever. And that happens normally with fighting games. If I play it for too much... Ooh, I, I, I perfected the combo. Okay. Oh, use it all, bitch. Use it all. Oh, snap, and I know what I'm doing immediately after I am done recording this. I don't know if you can see. Oh, I just want to say, real quick, that's Deadshot in the background. If he'll move. There's Deadshot. He is a playable character in Injustice 2. Okay. And I'm going to send you down here just so that I can make sure. I think from now on I'm probably going to do that every time I come to this area. Show off Gorilla Grodd down here and what's his name? Uh, Deadshot up in there. Alrighty. But, um, I just finished downloading the Not a Hero DLC for Resident Evil 7. I am fucking excited about that. Um, I can't wait because I'm going to play through all of the Resident Evil games, all the main series games at least. Um, I might also do Code Veronica, although it's a very hard game to, to fucking be without a guide. Which, if I have to use a guide, I'm sure you guys would understand, right? Um, I'm trying to think of who else should go in this fighting game. If you, how about you guys? I'll. I don't, know. I don't know why I'm going with this. How about you guys find... Do this with me. How about that? You guys do this with me. Find a roster template, whatever one you want to use, on Google Images. Uh, make it a PNG file, because that's just easier. I'd expect oh. better from a woman. This kitty has claws. Oh, shit. I'd expect better from a woman. Fucking flashpoint. Wonder Woman. Here. I know that that's Flashpoint because I've seen. I have the Flashpoint movie, and I have actually read the Wonder Woman Flashpoint storyline. I want to read more of it. Deadshot, old Slade Wilson, old one eye himself over here. Oh shit! Guess where we are? Begin. Oh, it's pirate Deadshot. Oh fucking dude! Fucking dude! Fucking dude! Let fucking dude! <laughs> What's he saying? Motherfucker. And is that Adam as well? Like, he's got the Adam symbol on his chest. Yes, this is definitely it.
Come here, bitch. Aha. Dark side. So there's dark side. Oh, fuck off. I can roll my R's, but I'm not very good at it. Fuck, dude. Deathstroke was giving me some issues. Um... Else should I put in a fighting game? Let's be let's be real guys. Let's let's sit back for a moment and think. Who would be good in a fighting game? I could put the doctor, I could put Steve from Minecraft. I mean why not, you know? Hey, he could have the diamond sword and the pickaxe and just different weapons. It'd be pretty cool. Fuck, I don't know. I don't know if, if I would want to do like movie characters or not. I don't know. Maybe put a po couple Pokemon, Again. just just a few. Um, I'm gonna have a couple pairs. Um, I can tell you I am going to have one very specific Cartoon Network pair in there. You can take that hint as to who it is, but that's why I'm very excited about. Um, my phone just plinged and I thought it was my girlfriend, but she's at work right now and she's not able to really be on her phone much. Um, and I'm like, oh shit. She messaged me, something might be up. She shouldn't be messaging me. And I look and it's from one of my bros and it says twelve tell twelve bros that you appreciate them or something. And I'm like, bro, not right now. Fuck off, Fleish. Fleish. <laughs> Um, I'm just like looking around my room. I think, I think I know what two characters from the Resident Evil franchise I'm gonna put in there. Um, I might put three. Imagine, imagine playing as a liquor from Resident Evil. That would be awesome. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put a liquor in there. Um, I've got one character right now from the Mario series, so the Mario franchise. <laughs> Um, but I don't know. This see, it's really tough. Like picking characters to be in a fighting game, you know? Bane. It's the bane of my existence. Yo, Catwoman is pretty fucking good. I like her circle button. It's probably my favorite one, actually. You build it up and then you use it, and you just fucking go up with it. Bane didn't stand a chance. Bane didn't stand a chance. Um, I could put a Harry Potter character in it, but that would be... I don't know. I, think, I, feel, I feel like that's too much, you know? Another mirror match. Playing against fucking Catwoman. What Catwoman though? I swear if it's Selena Kyle. 
Oh, and again. So I get to see them both in one anyway. that because they either die or they wager me. Fuck off, bitch. Holy shit, this bitch is crazy. This kitty has no, I'm not fucking I'll wagering this, bitch. <laughs> bitch tits, McGee. I'm doing it. Um... I've also thought about putting like cartoon characters in it. I've got one that I'm gonna put in there. For sure. Um, from a Fox show. Um, I don't know, like, would I wanna put like Peter Griffin in there? Probably not. I don't know. Um, it's really hard to decide what I want, who I want. I will tell you that I, I already have Dragonite from the Pokemon franchise. I'm going to perfect Pikmin one time. It's gonna happen before this is over. Fuck off, dude. Fuck off, dude. Fuck off! Okay, every time I hit him, he hits me faster. It doesn't make any sense. Oh my god! Every fucking time! Nigger, stop! Jesus. Ah, this guy's so annoying right now. I oh, fuck off, dude. I'll claw your eyes out. Not in the mood. You pissed me off. out of here dude too much you're too much for me just now so I mentioned Resident Evil now obviously I'm not going to be able to do Chris or Jill because I've already been in Marvel vs. Capcom I can't do Nemesis either but there are two other very important characters that I can put in there. Well, one other very important. This one, not so much. At last, Superman had paid for what he had done to Catwoman. Feigning allegiance to his regime had cost Selina her beloved Batman and her best chance at happiness. Pride and anger kept her from attempting reconciliation with Bruce Wayne, but his inspiring reconstruction of Gotham and Metropolis fostered in her a desire to remain close to him. Until she was ready to approach him again, she did her part to keep Gotham's streets clear of crime. Nascent underworld organizations had both the bat and the cat to fear. Hmm. Huh. That was, that was interesting. That was interesting. 
Um, it makes me want to watch more Gotham. I'm ready for that to come back on. Alrighty. Well, now that that is done, let us look and see what's next. Next is, uh, this is Deathstroke. That's, well, that's who's next. I knew that. And I'm gonna do Teen Titans. Definitely, definitely Teen Titans. Um, so, without further ado, I'm gonna get up out of here. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you did, leave a like. Be sure to uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Um, but yeah, without further ado, I'm gonna get up out of here. Bye bye.